8th of June 2017, do hereby give notice that the number of votes cast for each candidate at the election is as follows. Antoniazzi, Tonya, Welsh Labour. Llafir Cymru, 22,000... <laughs> That is 22,727. Davis, Byron, Welsh Conservative Party candidate. Am Gaisid Plaid Gaidwadol Cymru, Indignau Mil Pedwar Cant a Pimdigwith. 19,400. Yeah. Evans, Howard William. Welsh Liberal Democrats. Democratiaid Rhydfrydol Cymru, now cant Tridegin. 931. Ford, Ross, Ford, Ross Gareth, UKIP Wales, UKIP, UKIP Cymru. Chwe cant Pedwar Dig Dai. 642. Roberts, Harry. Plaid Cymru, the Party of Wales. In meal, chwe cant a chwe dig now. 1,669. <laughs> Winstanley, Jason. Pirate Party UK. In cant pedwar dig now. 149. Ac ar oedd hyn yn datgan bod... And I hereby declare that Tonya Antoniazzi has been duly elected. People of Gower have returned a Labour Member of Parliament. Thank you so much. I want to thank you for putting your trust in me and giving me this opportunity to represent you. And I promise to you that with every fibre of my body, I will work tirelessly to give you the representation that you and your family deserve. I will listen and act. I want to bring the often dusty politics of Westminster alive, involving people in discussion, decision-making and challenging ideas and the status quo. I want to thank the returning officer and all those involved in the count this evening, in particular the police. Their diligent work is what keeps our democracy moving. I want to thank my campaign team. This has been a fantastic effort. We have had, in the best six weeks of my life ever, and Adam, Adam, Michelle, the whole team, and the Gower Labour Party have been absolutely outstanding. I'm so looking forward... I'm looking forward to working alongside Rebecca Evans, our excellent Assembly member, to provide the excellent service you deserve. I'm proud to be Labour. I am proud of what this party has achieved, from founding of the NHS to being the architects of devolution. And I want to thank the party and its members for giving me this opportunity. I'm very pleased that the Green Party has shared our progressive vision for Gower and graciously did not field a candidate. I thank you. I also want to pay tribute to the other candidates standing in this election. Putting your name on the ballot paper takes real grit. Self-belief and a vision for the country, not just Gower. We may disagree on many issues, but Byron has served the people of this area for a number of years, first as a member of the National Assembly and for the last two as our MP. He has done so with integrity and has helped many people along the way. He deserves our thanks for his hard work and commitment. (laughs) 
as I stand here proudly as your newly elected MP, <laughs> I will promise to fight in Parliament to ensure Gower and the people of Wales have a country they can be proud of. Wales and the United Kingdom is deeply divided. In 2017, we are a society that displays a division I never thought I'd see again in my lifetime, be it Brexit, wealth or health. I want to thank my wonderful mother, son, partner, brothers with me who have stood by me every step of the way on this campaign. You have been my rock and a constant in a very turbulent six weeks. I want to help to create a country that they can be truly proud of, that we can be proud of, one that creates skilled jobs, one which respects and cares for our retired folk, and one which is fairer and more equal, giving young people the chance in life they deserve. So let's get this nation moving again. Let's create jobs, defend against inequality, and create a society for the many and not the few. Thank you.